This is going to be a two minute guide on how to create a Solana meme coin, deploy it, change metadata, add liquidity pool as well, and all that in just under a couple of minutes. So let's get started. First of all, we're going to use Metaboss. This is library which makes everything super simple because as you will see, once you have metadata, it will be just one line of code to do everything and deploy a token. However, first you need to install, uh, and this is all in the installation guide of Metaboss as well, you need to install and set up your Solana uh, CLI. This is, a, uh, this is an interface that you can use from the command line. And it's also easy to install. I'm going to post the link down below in the description as well. Uh, but you need to install the Solana to tool suite. Uh, and basically, after installation, uh, you will need to set up also uh, the, the, the keys here that you will use and the wallet that you will use on Solana. So if you haven't done that, you can either do that first in Phantom and import the, the private key into your Solana uh, command line uh, interface or do that directly from, Sol uh, from Solana CLI and create the wallet here. Uh, basically, they have all the instructions on what you need to do here. Uh, however, it's super easy, again, uh, to create a wallet. Uh, and once you have that, this will be your main wallet from which you will deploy uh, the, the token created through Metaboss. Uh, this is really easy here, and you basically will be connected to the Solana blockchain through your uh, terminal, through your command line. So once you have it, uh, have it done, uh, the, the command line will be set up, and you will be connected to uh, Solana. Now you're going to the Metaboss installation guide and basically you need to click on create uh, and here's the line that you need to do. Basically super simple as I've mentioned this is only one line However, you need to create this JSON file uh, and there's an example of that, but basically you can use exactly the same thing for the first time. So you can create this uh, crap JSON to see that it works well. Uh, also, I recommend doing that on DevNet so that you have this, the free uh, Solana tokens. You can get them from the faucet. You won't have to uh, waste your own Solana tokens. However, uh, it's pretty cheap on Solana to deploy tokens, so you can already do that on mainnet. Also, if you want to do it on, te on testing, it's pretty, pretty cheap. Uh, now, you have to prepare this JSON. Uh, there are a couple of examples here on how that might look, uh, but basically this is the simplest one. Uh, and then you have to uh, deploy that also. You have to have that on your uh, on your uh, laptop if you're deploying from laptop. And also this URI, as you can see, is deployed on Arweave. You can also deploy, deploy it on Pinata or some other IPFS uh, server. So IPFS server is the decentralized server where the file is. And in this URI, if you go to this address, you can click that and you will see that there's another file with uh, a link to the logo and as well uh, as a short description. So, so this uh, file will also have to be on Arweave as well as with the logo uh, or on Pinata or on other IPFS server. And once you have that, you are good to deploy. And basically this is all it takes to deploy a token. Metaboss create fungible uh, D6M crap JSON and this is done. You can also add initial supply and you will have a token. So basically in those couple of steps, you can create a token super fast. Uh, this is this will be SPL token uh, mint with metadata. So already in Phantom, this will appear with metadata. You will have an image next to the token that you deploy and you got a good to deploy to have and add liquidity. So if you want other people to trade with this token, uh, you will need to go to either app meteora.ag or Radium and add liquidity there. Uh, Meteora is much simpler. It basically works like Uniswap version two, where you just add the pool. Uh, once you connect the wallet, you add the pool and that's it. You don't have to do anything more. You don't pay anything more. Uh, you just add the tokens like Sol plus the token you created and add the Meteora uh, pool. Or another thing is going with Radium. It's a little bit more complicated and you have to pay more because you have to create uh, this uh, this entire ecosystem. Uh, if you, you go to liquidity, you need to cr click on create pool and then you will create open book market ID. There's a detailed guide for that. You will have to pay a couple of sol to do that. Um, but generally speaking, most of the meme coins are trying to do that because the, the liquidity pool here is to some extent better. However, starting with Meteora is definitely a good start. And also if you add more than $500, $500 of liquidity, uh, your pool will be listed on Jupiter. Jupiter is the main aggregator. They, they aggregate all the pools. So people will be able to buy uh, your coin also on Jupiter. 
uh, after uh, after there's enough of liquidity and there are at least I think a couple of transactions. So this is it for deploying a, a token. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, if you have any problems. I might do a more detailed guide as well. But for the start, I think this should do definitely MetaBoss. Uh, plus Solana CLI plus Meteora is the fastest way to create a token and you can basically do everything in like five, 10 minutes all together. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Uh, I really uh, like the subscriptions. So subscribe and see you in the next video.